Hello friends, I am Dr. Prashant Sharma and we are watching Medicos Hub. In this video, I am going to discuss the derivatives of monosaccharides. There are five major categories of derivatives of monosaccharides. First one is deoxy sugars, second one is phosphorylated derivatives, third one is amino sugars, then sugar acids and sugar alcohols. We can learn them by D pass. D means deoxy sugars, phosphorylated derivatives, amino sugars, sugar acids and sugar alcohols. So this is part A of this lecture and I will discuss the first three. First is deoxy sugars. Now what are these deoxy sugars? Monosaccharides in which any OH that is hydroxyl group is substituted by H then it is termed as deoxy sugar for example 2 deoxy D ribose This is 2 deoxy ribose. We can see that at carbon 2, hydroxyl group is replaced by hydrogen. This is utilized or it is uh, an important component of DNA, nucleic acid, genetic material. Now, second example is L fucose. This is L fucose So this L fucose here we can see that hydroxyl group is replaced by H This L fucose participates in Synthesis of surface antigens on RBC which participates in ABO blood group system. Now the next group is phosphorylated derivatives. Now, now what is the effect of phosphorylation? Phosphorylation induces negative charge on sugar and it prevents the spontaneous or easy living of sugars from the cell through the membrane. Another thing is that it activates the sugar for further reaction. So these are phosphorylated derivatives for example glucose 6-phosphate. Now, the third one that is amino sugars. What are amino sugars? Amino sugars are those sugars or monosaccharides in which hydroxyl group is replaced or substituted by 
ammonia group. For example, glucosamine. Now, the structure of glucosamine. This is D glucosamide. The second, in the same way, galactosamine can be synthesized. And D mannosamine can also be synthesized. And acetyl. Glucosamine, which is acetylated derivative, it can also be synthesized. And acetyl, neuraminic acid. What is the structure of N acetyl neuraminic acid? COH, H, H, OH, H, OH, N, CH3, C. So this is the structure of N acetyl neuraminic acid. N acetyl neuraminic acid plus its derivatives are collectively termed as sialic acid. In addition, we can also add some antibiotics like erythromycin. So these are the various derivatives of monosaccharides. In the next lecture, we'll discuss few more derivatives of monosaccharides, that is sugar acids and sugar alcohols. Hit the like button, share and subscribe our channel to get the latest updates and notifications.